Yeah, so there are uh, in triple negative breast cancer, again, a very aggressive uh, disease type. Uh, there has been an unmet need for years. And uh, in the last years, we've had advances with immunotherapy that became standard of care for about 40% of patients uh, that express PDL1. The, the, uh, the tumors express PDL1. This is 40% in the first line uh, in combination with chemotherapy. We have now also the approval of sasituzumab govitecan after uh, uh, first line. This is an anti, uh, antibody drug conjugate targeting it. Uh, and uh, for patients uh, with germline BRCA mutations, BRCA1 or BRCA2, uh, we have the PARP uh, inhibitors. Now moving forward, the uh, PARP inhibitors uh, are showing activity in other uh, alterations, for example, the somatic uh, BRCA1 and 2 mutations. So in a, in a small phase 2 study, we saw activity in germline PALB2 uh, mutations. And there are also other targets that are investigational, such as uh, notch uh, alterations. Uh, we're going to see this afternoon um, at ASCO uh, low HER2 expression. So part of these patients have uh, triple negative breast cancer uh, disease. And the advances in genomic um, uh, sequencing, we might also detect other targets that can be uh, targeted. So at ASCO, we've seen, for example, HER3 uh, ADC that was tested.